What's up, everyone? Dr. Tansini here at Ground Overhead PT. Welcome to your daily body armor with Tank. Now, today we're going to be going over the elbow and in particular what a lot of you all know as golfer's elbow. Or we see it a lot in the CrossFit gym. We see it a lot in weightlifting, in obstacle course racing. Um, anything or any sport where we see a lot of gripping, um, we see a lot of stress and torques on that elbow. Uh, that's when these issues are going to show up the most. So that's exactly what we're going to be covering today. Now, prior to jumping in, subscribe to the channel. We come at you daily. Don't miss a way to bulletproof your body and be your best self. All right. So hit the button, hit the like, and let's get into action. So now often right on the inner part of that elbow, you're going to feel it doing pull-ups, doing those rope climbs, maybe in that front rack to that clean, maybe up overhead, whether you're in a handstand push-up or a um, or a snatch or, or a jerk or overhead squat to where the inside of the elbow is just feeling super cranky. Now, often that's from the combined stresses of not being uh, positionally competent uh, to have those positions that you need to so that you can load the arm without that excessive stress on that elbow, or uh, you've done a little bit too much gripping and you're not strong enough uh, and robust enough to handle at that insertion point of those forearm muscles, the, the loads and stresses that you actually need to do to be able to perform that stuff long term without any issues. So, one of their issue or one of their uh, mechanisms or actions is going to be rotation. Okay, so now you might find like opening up a door, opening up a jar also hurts at the gym. And that's because these muscles here are going to be the ones involved there. So we're going to grab a PVC or like a dowel uh, at the gym. Um, now. You can make this easier or tougher by the length of the PVC that you use. So if you want to make it super tough, put it all the way up or grab it all the way at the bottom. Okay. And if we're focusing on the inner part of, of that elbow, we're going to keep the elbow tight and just come out nice and slow. Now, as you do this, you're going to load this portion of the elbow nice and slow out, nice and slow back in. Now, it's the same thing, nice and slow out. Taking it all the way through your available range of motion. Then all the way back in. Now, if you're dealing with elbow pain here, uh, you're most likely going to have some discomfort there. I want you to pick a length of the PVC, right, by moving the hand up or down on the PVC. Uh, which allows you to do the movement with minimal discomfort. I want you to feel it, but I don't want it to be stabbing. So as you get better at it, move the hand down. You're going to do this four to five seconds down, four to five seconds up in the 12 to 15 rep range, nice and slow. Um, if you have some discomfort, that's okay. But this is a great way to start zapping that inside elbow pain. So guys, I'm Dr. Tank, Dr. Tansini. Get back to your workouts. Give this a go. Reach out if you need anything, and I'll see you next time.